So you have this amazing body of work for how old you are. It's like you have the body of work of a 40-year-old woman. <laughs> <laughs> and I Just not the wisdom. <laughs> um, well, no, it's interesting. I guess I started when I was about 16. It was purely just because I really loved it and it was necessary. It became essential to do it. Um, and the plus side was that you could do it professionally. Um, and I was given that opportunity and, and followed that through. But it's very strange because the success of it is something which is so external and seems to me to be decided by everyone else. And you have to decide where you're going to find happiness, whatever that means, um, and really kind of consider that it's not just one thing. Absolutely. But it's funny, isn't it, too, because you you also can be so hard on yourself at times, which I think is, is actually extremely important to keep going with anything. But it is true. If you, if you recounted your last year to somebody, yeah, it, yeah. most people would be like, that's crazy. Yeah. It's, it's, and I, I hope it always remains completely absurd um, because the sense of the absurd is, is what seems to keep all of us sane. I, I read a quote from, maybe it was The Independent when you were like 17 years old and you said the reason you like acting is because no one knows what's going to happen. Yeah. There was this yeah. idea that fate was gonna sort of decide your path and, yeah. and to me I think like, okay, that's a seventeen year old talking, but yeah. bullshit. <laughs> <laughs> but if you can if you can handle that kind of uncertainty in your life, yeah. that's Sometimes, and, and don't you find too, I mean, it must have been the same when, when you were that age, how you think about life in the sense of uh, these chapters, these kind of endless chapters in front of you, and then suddenly you're in the midst of them, and your taste has changed in the last decade drastically, and, and how you define happiness has changed, and, and all these different priorities um, have kind of been reassembled, and you just transform so very much, as you should hopefully to be a functioning human being. But something about the uncertainty of it is always attractive, probably just by being quite a restless person at heart and wanting to travel and yeah. have that opportunity to see the world. But also the unknowable nature of human beings. That's why I thought about it a lot. And I think that's why acting can be such a amazing vocation because we're all unknowable. You never really know the truth behind somebody's it's, eyes. It's true. And it's, that kind of yeah. is extraordinary when you think about that.